rather than freeze and McCutcheon in scoring possession. Whoa. A balk is going to be called, we believe. Yes. A balk is called. The Pirate bench noticed it right away. Derek Norris is arguing, but boy, the bench immediately reacted and called the balk. And then Ryan Blakeney, the first base umpire, followed through with it. And we haven't seen that from Andrew McCutcheon, but that's a great play. Uh, bluffing his way down thir the third base line with uh, Ray and the windup. Oh, absolutely. Oh, yeah. Now, how can the umpires be? What in the world are they discussing? Watch Andrew McCutcheon. What a play by McCutcheon to aggressively go down there and throw Ray off his game. That's exactly what he was trying to do. That right there was trying to get a balk, trying to get Ray to do something different. But again, what is the debate? Brian Gorman going to go over and talk to uh, Hurdle. Hurdle go ballistic here. Hurdle will go ballistic. There is no way you can overturn a balk call like this. Uh, you, uh, uh, I don't know that this ever happened. Certainly yeah. not that we've ever seen a balk call get overturned. Cutchin, everybody saw him jumping. Yeah. I mean, you saw him change his windup. Wow. Wow. Never seen that before. No. A ball call get overturned. Now, there must have been a, an explanation for Clint Hurdle there that, um, you know, because his reaction isn't nearly as. See, it was like a little hop, it almost looked like. As, as he was starting, you know, he started his delivery and he came through, but there was almost like a, a hop. And now what? Now what? Now Clint, oh, Clint went back to the dugout. He saw Kevin Roach. He, Kevin Roach, the videographer, told him exactly what happened. So now they've seen it on replay, and now Hurdle's hot. Now that he has confirmed with the Pirate Clubhouse, Kevin Roach, the video coordinator, exactly what happened. And that. Now we're going to get into this debate, John. You're going to have replay. Yeah. That is crazy that you can't, that, that Gorman can't get on right now to New York and, and they can confirm it right away and say, yep, it's a balk. Yeah, I guess if you can go and call a balk and then say it's not a balk, we certainly should be able to, re Absolutely. to replay it. I and now they're going to, con oh, look at this. How about this? Would this be something? Andy Green, who's a light uh, mannered rookie skipper. Oh, how about this? They're going to call the wow. block after all. Oh, my goodness. They called the block. Then they called it off, and now they call it again. <laughs> He's wondering, do I have to touch home again? <laughs> but, uh, Hurdle is directing him to home plate. One of the craziest things I've ever How seen. How about that? So McCutcheon scores again. That is incredible. <laughs> it's incredible. I mean, it, replay wasn't used literally, but Hurdle used it to convince the umpiring crew. Wow. Brian Gorman, the crew chief. Mark Carlson, the home plate umpire. And I'm guessing if you're Andy Green, you have to be asking, well, what made you change your mind in the first place? And now how can you change it back? 
Now, he's going to get, well, he just gets tossed. Mild-mannered Andy Green. This is the first outburst that Padres fans have seen. going to become the manager. <laughs> An interesting twist. McGuire left the Dodgers. There he is. Big Mac is the bench coach here. So he'll take over the lineup card. And a bizarre turn of events here. Jow's talking to uh, Andrew McCutcheon and others about what he saw from the bench. So there goes Andy Green. And the Pirates lead 2 0. 